So where did I go? Nowhere. Let's begin. Okay, so today I'm going to be unboxing a brand new product. Actually, it's an old but new product. New on my side, on my side, and whatever. And yeah, this has been there for a long period of time in their company, but it's giant, crazy, crazy. In case you didn't know, I've been working with with one uh, normal soldering iron that you have seen me use in a few videos. I'm sure. The tip is fully like coated with plastic residue, and the stand is totally gone. So I got myself a brand new soldering station from my good friends. So yeah, let me open the package. So I have my trusty little knife. Sure, sure. Even though it's only a 12 watt, I'm sure that it's the best. It's easy safe too, which is good. Yeah, I really don't know why they went overboard with the tape. Don't ever do this. Don't ever put a knife towards you. Put it towards your cat or your money, your cat or your dog. Put it towards your uh, neighbor. Your team. This uh, if you are like a bonus. By the way, this is not this these are the things that come with the thing. And yeah, it comes with solder wire as well, I think given by the focus. Hey you focus! Yeah. It's called the Kentucky G solder wire. Really don't know what's up with the name though. I guess you don't know. I actually do own a Kentoji, but it's like used. And yes, the elixir. Actually, I tested this out, this thing alone. Used it as well. That's why it's a bit like crusty looking. But still, it comes with a coaxial kind of a plug. So, still. Let's see this. And then, oh yeah, this is our soldering station controller box. Yeah, that goes. Okay, so this looks nice. Actually, it looked when I bought it though. So, yes. And there's some of the covers on these things. Really don't know. And yeah. The soldering iron looks very cheap though, and this um, cheapness is like. Making no sense, even though the bit is interchangeable, which is nice. Focus. Yeah, it comes with the SND tip, which is good. And the controller is so freaking small. I like actually this only costed around five US dollars. Not even five, I think it costs you only around two or something, which is awesome. And it comes with a stand in it, which is a bit dangerous, but I don't mind. So, yes, by the way, it has a low and a high, it doesn't have any voltage definition thing. Actually, I know people who have the costlier versions, like Get Scott, and all of those people. Who use like these, uh, yeah, uh, soldering stations that cost like what, one thousand bucks maybe? I really don't know, but yeah, the solder is quite useful. Thank you, shop. Yeah. So now let me just unstrip this thing. I just plugged it in and tested it out. And I wrap this back up wherever it was. So yes. This is the coaxial cable I was talking about. And yeah, let me plug this in. S smooth. Oh, it's there. It will make a lot 
outside. Yeah. And then this thing inserts in like that. And yeah. The cable is quite thin, but I don't mind. It's only 12 volt, 12 watts only. Yeah. 12 volt. So along with my fake standy glue gun, which is a dot. Yeah, this is the solding station plugged in. Let me turn it on. Temperature at high. And let me give it some time to heat up. ran out of space but still I think it has heated up it's a pretty average um, two minute heating time I'm guessing so yeah I just opened up my old solder wheel I would like to call that yeah this is my solder wheel in case you didn't know okay have some solder let me just try Not bad. Hmm, nice, not bad at all. Okay. Hey, come on, man. Okay, I think I have to get myself a PCB. I'll be back. I am sure I should be doing this to clean soldering tip though. Yeah, the soldering iron is actually quite good to the touch. But this place gets a bit warm though. I am a bit tough. Kentoji is the same brand I got for the thing as well. I'm sure it is the same, uh, what do you say, the solder wheel or whatever. And I think we can move on to the quality rating maybe. I think we'll find that in the end like a picture or some animation or something. So this has been everyone in AIC Crazy. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. And one more thing, um, in case you wish to purchase this and I somehow successfully do find a kit available online, I will link it in the description below. Thank you for watching. Hope to see you next time. You know where this thing finally goes and says, I think I have to replace this seat right here. Go there.
Goodbye.